Hi everyone, how are you doing? I hope you're doing really well. It's a beautiful spring day out. It's not very warm. It's supposed to warm up tomorrow. But I love spring and summer. But you may be wondering why I have my Cricut Joy just sitting there. Because it was easier to carry down here where I film than bringing my Explore. So I'm excited to tell you I've been to a few of my Dollar Trees and two of them just putting out, believe it or not, wait till I show you the items, their Crafter Square Cricut supplies. And it's going to blow your mind when you see what they have. And the other store already had their stock hanging and I couldn't believe what I saw. So I'm going to show you the footage from that and then I'm going to show you what I purchased and then I'm actually going to try it out for you. And there was also another item. It was frosted window film. Which, and that is something that I believe Cricut carries. Not Caesar, yeah, it's Cricut. Cricut carries that. And this was a dollar. So just watch and see. Whoa. Did my store get supplies in for your Cricut? Oh my goodness. Let's see, it says vinyl paper. Let me get that glare out of there. Transfer tape. And this one is in gold. And down here we have black. Here we have pink. And silver. Also have tools. They have what they're calling a craft picker which is a weeding tool and a scraper. How cool is this? Yes, I'll be getting some of this. Cool and purple too. Oh my gosh, and I have been looking all over every Dollar Tree for these. It's the frosted window film but it can be used with your Cricut. I bought this for a lot more at Julian Fabrics. And it says it is 11.8 inches by 47 inches. And it comes in two patterns. And it has a check mark on the one that's in the box. Oh, I am definitely getting these. I love to put these on my car windows and house windows. Cut them out on my Cricut. Oh, yeah. Finally, I found them. I've been to about six Dollar Trees. So I'll have to let you guys know how they work. It even shows you on the front and back how to use it. Like, it gives you instructions on the back to use that your windows off and then how to put it on this way but I would cut shapes out on my Cricut which I've done plenty of okay y'all second store hasn't even put them out yet but somebody got into the boxes but this one even has the craft spatula and they have the craft picker too and the vinyl but what I'm confused about, hold on, is this. Look at the transfer tape. Unless one is supposed to be for the joy machine, but it's still better to buy the longer one because the longer one is 12 by 38 and the smaller one is five and a half by 38. Watch out for that when you're buying this. Okay, I'm so excited. Okay, so I got a few things. I wanted to try the vinyl out first. See how it works. I'm going to try it out for you guys. But this says vinyl paper, permanent glitter paper in rose gold. And on the side over here, it says matte. And it's actually a pink glitter. It's really pretty. The camera's not doing it justice. I'm looking at the camera screen. It's a pretty color. 
but it's definitely a rose gold. So what else I got, and I can't believe this, they also have transfer tape. How cool is that? But the other thing I noticed, like I said in the store video, was they had two sizes in this. They had a smaller one and this one, and I'm just thinking that the other one maybe they put out for the Cricut Joy, but you actually get more inches with this one. So I would probably go with this one. This one is 12 by 38 inches. And wait till I show you what else I got. Oh my goodness. They have waiting tools. Let's see if I can get a hold of these. And they're in color. This one is kind of a mm, taupey color maybe. And it actually says craft picker instead of weeder. But how cool is that? a dollar and they have what they're calling I'm not sure what Cricut calls theirs because I don't really use this too much but this is for using cardstock and things a craft spatula for a dollar and hold on they have this in a few colors too. A craft scraper. They have a scraper. This is so cool. It says apply materials, clean large areas. Okay. Now, I got two other items that aren't craft or square, but that can be used on a Cricut. And I've bought Cricut's window cling before. And they just got this in. How about that? It says frosted window film. It is 11.8 by 47 inches. Oh my gosh, I have paid so much more for this at Joanne Fabrics. Like they had sell this for like 30 some dollars, but I usually use the coupon, especially the 60% off coupon. And it shows you the di two different patterns that they have. And if you can see this, the one that's checked is a floral pattern. And this is just like little teeny tiny little squares. And I've already tried this out. Oh my gosh, I love this so much more. And then on the back, it shows you that you should clean your surface and tells you what to do before you apply it. That is a great buy. So, like I said, it comes in two different patterns, and they're both checked. Whichever one is checked is the one, obviously, that's in the box. For a dollar! So, I'm going to try these out for you, even though I've tried them out already. I love them. And what I already made with these is a couple of, of the bunny peeps for Easter. I made them about ten and a half inches, I believe, long. And they're so cute, and they stick so well to the window. Wait till you see them. Okay, so I decided, since I have the Cricut Joy down here, we'll just work with the Cricut Joy. So I'm going to go ahead, and I'm going to try this dolphin. And I'm using the one that has the little squares. I don't know if you can see that on camera or not. Yeah, I think you can. I turn it sideways. We're going to get the scraper out and flatten it, but I'm going to try and put that dolphin and see how that comes out. So let me get the scraper out, try all these, just to see how they work. Feels like the real one. Okay. Alright, scrape it down. And you want to put it right side up. Okay. Alright, get that ready, and we'll send this picture over to the joy, that one, insert, and we will make it, hmm, let's see, it's kind of wide, so maybe we'll go with the width, because the joy only cuts four inches wide. So let's just measure this with the width. So the width is four inches. 
So we'll go just below that maybe. Okay. All right. Okay, and we're going to hit make it. And we're using a mat. There it is. So let's bring it down in the center a little bit and continue. Connect to a paired machine by tapping connect. We're already paired. To pair a new machine. Okay, we're already paired. We're paired. There we go. Okay. Bluetooth pairing request. Okay. Success paired. Connect. And wants to know what materials we're using. So I always go to all materials. And window cling is usually the last one on here. Uh oh, I don't see it on here. Uh oh, what do we do? Let's see. Oh, there's window cling. It's in a different place than it is when I use my Explorer, but there it is right there. Press that, and it's ready to go. Okay, let's take it in. It's going to take it in. I'm going to check it out. Bring it up closer so it's got room to cut it. Go. And it starts cutting. Let's see how good this cuts it. I already did it on my Explorer too. While it's cutting, let me get the weeding tool out. Weeding tool. Take that out of the package so we can try that out. Oh, that's really in there. Okay. All right, we got the weeding tool out. Here it is. Okay, it's done. And it says this on my phone. Upload, up, unload. And it unloaded itself. So it's finished. So let's see what we got here. It's a lot of live demonstration. <laughs> okay. Let's weed her out. Always like to grab one corner. Got it. See that? See it coming up? Okay. All right. I'll pull that excess off. Put that off to the side. And we're going to see what we have to weed. Let me look at the picture. Can you see that where it cut it? The dolphins are on there. Okay. Let's get the center out. Get that piece. Okay, we need to get the eyeballs. Got the eyeballs. And get the mom's eyeball. Oh, I took it off the screen. No, I didn't get it yet. So here comes the mom's eyeball. And let's get the babies. The babies moved over off to the side. There we go. And. I think there's a piece in here. No, that came out. That came out when we poured it up. And I think that's it. So let's take the dolphin up. And make it cut perfect. Perfect. Oh my goodness. I'm going to have to put this on something so you guys can see it better. Of course, you can't see it on my hand. Put it on something dark. Let's see, what do we got? Oh, they're matte. Cool beans. Let's see how it looks on here. It looks better on a window, but let's see if you can see it on here for right now. 
just for demonstration purposes. And there's Mommy and Baby! Oh, how cute! I don't have it all the way on there. I'm just demoing it, but there we go. Now it's on there. How cute is that? And like I'm telling you, that thing, that is on there. That is on there really good. And that's just on the back of this. It clings really good to glass, to a window. So I'm going to do the other design. Look, oh, look, you can really see it. How cool. Oh my goodness. This is too pretty. Oh, I love it. Okay, so we're going to try the floral one. Let me get that piece cut out and put on the mat for you. Be right back. I'm all set with the second one. Just chose this little butterfly. See how it comes out with the floral design. So let's get this going. Hit make it on a mat. And I'm going to move it down just a little bit. Because I like where the floral design looks like right about there. Okay, so we're going to go down and find that. Window cling again, and there it is. Hit window cling. Okay, it's ready to load. Let's load her up. Pull it down some more. And then on my phone, or whatever you're using, just hit go. Here's the butterfly. I'll show you again. Because it's a little more intricate than the peeps bunnies that I did. All you had to cut out on the peeps bunnies was the shape around the body. And the two eyes and the nose on one. And then the second one was just the tail. Like to see how this comes out, especially with the floral design of the window cling, or as Dollar Tree calls it, the window. What they call it the window film. phone you would hit unload and let's see what we got okay now to weed it I'd like to grab a corner oh that came out really nice okay and just pull the outside away and this one even has antennas you gotta be careful with the antennas And we just have to weed away the heart. Get a hold of that. Get a little tiny heart. I should put that on my cricket. <laughs> put it on my Dewey. Okay. All right, and I'm gonna get this up. I'm not sure if you guys can see it from there. On here. I'm going to get it off of there and put it on the back of my green cutting mat from the Dollar Tree and show you what it looks like until I get it on a piece of glass. So let me get that little mat. I didn't want you guys to miss out. It comes up real easy off the paper, the backing. I already started this one wing, but the antennas came up real nice. Look at that. 
came up really nice. So let me stick it on here just so you can see it. So I get it up on a window or a piece of glass. So let's see how it looks. The antenna's down. And the bo oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Look at that. It's so pretty. Oh, I love the floral print. That is so pretty. Okay. I'm very happy with this. All right, now let's cut out the vinyl. And I just want to remind you when you're doing the window cling, make sure that this backing is against your mat, the sticky side, like that. Okay, so my vinyl came out of the package a little crushed, but that's okay, we can still work with it. This part's a fine. This part's a fine. <laughs> I was going to like the shuffle on Sesame Street or Muppets. Okay, let's take it right from the top. We're going to hit New Project. Replace the old project. Hit Upload. Upload Images. Go down. I'm going to go down to this Mommy and Baby Dolphins. Click on that. Hit Insert. Then we're going to size it. So I'm going to make it just under 4 inches because we have about four and a half inches to work with with our Cricut. That should be good. Now we're going to hit make it on a mat. I'm going to bring it down just a teensy bit in the center. Continue. Oh, I don't want to do that. I want to hit connect. Okay, all materials. And this is vinyl. So we get down here to find vinyl and there is no glitter vinyl, which is what this is. This is starting to have frosted vinyl. So I'm going to hit frosted. Okay. And it's ready to go. I'm going to put that in the machine. It's going to take it through and make sure everything is okay. And then back to the phone, we're going to hit go. And it's going to start cutting. I'm curious how this is going to come out. Cutting this type of vinyl. It seems thinner than other vinyls that I've used. I don't know if that's going to be a good thing or a bad thing. I do see where it cut the baby dolphin's eye out. It's not there anymore. There's a hole there, but there's nothing to weed out. It's got to be there somewhere. Okay, back to my phone. It says unload. So we hit unload, and there we go. It's done. Now I'm going to weed it. Okie dokie. Let's weed them out. Again, I'm going to take a corner, lift the corner up. I hear an ice cream truck outside. That came up really nice. The outside is weeding perfect. And I need to find out where that little eye went, but let's get the mom's eye. Got her eye which is stuck to my finger. Let's get the inside. Where did the baby's eye go? Because I don't want it to be stuck there somewhere. Hmm. I don't see it. There it is, all weeded. So now we're just gonna put it on the cup. Okay, so what I noticed so far, I put obviously the vinyl on the mat and when I used the scraper, it kind of scraped the vinyl. I, don't, I think you guys can see that. It's kind of a darker mark. Okay. Okay, when you're using a surface like this, or glass, just take some alcohol and rub the outside of it. 
And this is to clear away any fingerprints or oils from someone. Anything, we want to keep that clear so that it adheres better. Okay, alrighty, let's apply the transfer tape. Now, cut it a little long, but that's okay. All right. All right, let's try it. I'm going to peel it back this way. that this works. How about that? So far so good. Well the transfer tape works and really easily. I'm really shocked. All right there it is. I'm gonna try and put it on this cup. Maybe a little bit too big. No I think I did it just right. Yeah. All right, so on a rounded object like this, I'm going to start with the center down and then go from there and put it down like this. Don't get any bumps and bubbles. And the same with this side. Just take it slow. Just move your finger down. Okay. Let's see if I'm going to need the scraper. Let's see if my finger worked well enough. Oh my gosh. You guys. Look at that. I am shocked. I am really shocked. Oh my gosh. I am so shocked. Okay, I did make it a tad bit too big, but that's okay. This was just a demo, but look at that. I mean, that went on there really, really nice. Especially on a rounded edge like that. All right, let me pull you back some. So here it is, you guys. It worked really well. I mean, time will tell how long it's going to stay on there, but the tape worked really well. The vinyl worked really well. I, I'm shocked. I really am. Look at that. Okay, I wanted to show you real quick what it did to the mat. Well, actually to the vinyl, it cut right through. But I mean, that's no problem. I can get that right out. But I just wanted to show you guys that it did stick. I think I can get it right up. <laughs> yeah, it's coming up. So I just wanted to show you that. It did stick to the mat. And this is a standard grip mat. It's not a strong grip. So what are my thoughts? Um, obviously, you guys know I'm very happy with the frosted window cling. And I am actually happy with the way this turned out and the transfer tape, shockingly. The only thing I wasn't happy with was it sticking to my mat, but I can clean that up. So if you guys think you'd like to try this out, get to your Dollar Tree. They're just now starting to get them in and put them out. Now I went to a Dollar Tree today and they didn't have them yet. They did have the window cling but they didn't have the vinyl and the Cricut type material and accessories. Okay, so I want to show you these guys one last time. And here's the cup again. And I will take some pictures and some video and put them on a piece of glass, the static or static cling, <laughs> the window clings. I'll put the window clings on some glass and I will take some video and some pictures so I hope this video was helpful 
and I want to thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. And I hope you'll give me a big like and subscribe. And thanks again for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.